Hi, and welcome to Path of Programming. Um, last last video, we talked about refactoring, and we also started refactoring this uh, tennis game class. And we've already improved the readability of it, but we can do some more things. So last time, we looked at tackling the easy stuff, um, getting, getting rid of the clutter, uh, getting the low-hanging fruit, uh, which is renaming fields, renaming methods, extract method, remove temp variables. And this time, we will unroll for loop. So let's go down to this ongoing result here. Now, if we look at this for loop right here, you can see that i starts at one and and it only goes to two. So we can actually do something. See that's repeating twice. So what we could do is we could actually just repeat it here. And now we can get rid of this and just say i equals one. Now I can say equals two. Run the test. Okay, we're still passing here. Uh, we're actually gonna keep the braces here. Braces are gonna come in handy. Okay, so let's do one thing and extract this into a method. So this will be get score as string. Okay, so now we can continue with unrolling this. So if i equals one, if i equals one, then we do this. So we can get rid of this else because we know i equals one, we can get rid of this. Actually, just inline that. Okay, let's run the test. Okay, awesome. So now we have this else block. Run the test. We're still green. Now we don't need this I anymore. And now we have this part, we're concatenating. This is temporary. Okay, so we can do one thing here. We can actually, instead of concatenating, we can just return. So then we'll just return those. Uh, so it didn't work. So this is the one of the times that we do something. It didn't work and we roll it back. So let's let's tackle this again. Let's instead just remove these from the test. Now we can get to more of a one line here. So instead of concatenating up here, we can just add it. Same thing here. Okay, that looks good. So now instead of doing this, we can do that. And now score is a bit of a problem. So now we should be able to go here. Just a lot of times I'm kind of worried because we're red. So we want to get to green really fast. Um, looks like we need a default case. So 
why don't we have love be the default case? Um, it looks like can actually change a signature. Get rid of this. Oh, yeah, we're green again. All right, so temp score, I'd rather this be just score. So passing the score string value um, and now we can actually just inline this and now our ongoing result looks like this so we're able to unroll that for loop okay so now we've tackled the low-hanging fruit we've unrolled the for loop and I'll see you next time and we'll clean up this code even further